In this configuration example, we will do the basic configuration of a Cisco router. We will take our router below and access to its CLI. The router has just started, so we will wait a little. At the beginning, we are in user exec mode. To enter privilege exec mode, we will use enable. At the beginning, there is no enable password. But in this lesson, we will also configure enable password. To configure our router, we should enter configuration mode. To enter configuration mode, we will use configure terminal command. Firstly, let's change our router name with hostname command. As you can see, our new router name is here. Now, let's set enable secret password with enable secret command. Let's use 1234567 as enable secret password. To encrypt all passwords in routing table, we will also use service password encryption command. Let's check our password in the running configuration. I will use show run command to see it. Our enable secret password is here as encrypted. Now, we will configure console connection, but to do this, we will go to configuration mode with configure terminal command. We will start the console configuration with line console zero. Then we will set password as Cisco123. Password Cisco123. We will use login command. By doing this, we are saying that ask this password during console connection. We will also set history size. We can give any value between 0 and 256. Here, we can also use logging synchronous command. By doing this, we prevent logs to break our commands during the configuration. Another important command is exec timeout command. With exec timeout command, we specify the timeout for exec sessions. Here, I will use 00. zero. This means that never timeout. We will configure also telnet sessions from 0 to 15. To do this, we will use line vty 015 command. We will also set a password for telnet sessions. I will set Cisco123. Again, for password ask during telnet connection, we will use login command. Now it is time to do an interface IP address configuration example. Let's go to interface gigabyte thernet 0 slash 0 interface. It is saying that there is no such interface here. Let's check our interfaces with show IP interface brief command. You will use this command too much in your job. Yes, we have no gigabit ethernet interface. So I will use fast ethernet zero slash zero interface. Interface fast ethernet zero slash zero. We will open the interface with no shutdown command. All routers interfaces are down by default. So we should open them. I will use 10.0.0.1 slash 24 IP address for this interface. IP address 10.0.0.1255.255.0. Lastly, I will configure a console message which will appear during login. To do this, we will use banner MOTD command with letter D. Here, D is the letter which will show the end of the message. As message, I will enter Merhaba, Hello, Bonjour, Namaste. And lastly, I will finish with letter D. Now, I will save my configuration with write command. You can also use copy running config startup config command. Now let's check the running configuration and see our configurations. As you can see, our configurations are all here. Host name, enable secret password, interface configs, console message, console and telnet connection configurations. 
Now let's use logout command to log out and see our console message and try to log in with new passwords. Our console message is here. Console login password was Cisco123. And enable password was 1234567. In this Cisco router configuration example, we have done key configurations of a Cisco router. Do not forget to subscribe. Good luck.